Hi students, in this session I am going to teach you how to solve a box problems. See these are the type of problems you may observe from chemical kinetics chapter. You may stuck at one point how to solve that. Uh, I, I will teach you how to solve by using simple methodologies. Let's begin the session. First I will uh, teach you this question. For A solid plus B solid gives rise to C solid. Rate is given. What is the rate? Just you observe. Rate is rate is K into A to the power of 1 by 2. B to the power of 2. This is the uh, you know rate they have given. If initial concentration of A and B are increased by 4 and 2. They were telling that these concentrations are increased. This is increased by 4 times and this is increased by 2 times. We have to find the how much time that initial rate was changed. So what you have to do is simply they were telling you initial concentration of A and B are increased by 4 and 2. So, let's take this uh, rate expression, you know, uh, as an R1. Make it as an equation 1. And R2, write R2. K into uh, A concentration increased 4 times. So, 4A to the power of 1 by 2. B is increased 2 times given in question. So, 2B power 2. This is same. What is given in question, I am writing. This is increased 4 times, this is increased 2 times. So, 2B I, I, I wrote, this is equation 2. Now, I will take equation 2 divided by equation 1. How much it will be? R2 divided by R1 is equal to same expression. What is there? You take. And this is the textbook methodology. What I am writing now is textbook methodology. R2 by R1 I am taking. After that, you, uh, you know, uh, A to the power of 1 by 2, A to the power of 1 by 2 will be cancelled. And, uh, uh, you know, K, K will be cancelled. B to the power of 2, B to the power of 2 will be cancelled. What is left? 4, A to the power of 1 by 2, 1 by 2 cancelled, right? So, 4 to the power of 1 by 2 is left. So, 4 to the power of 1 by 2 and 2 to the power of 2 is left. So, it is root uh, 4 is, root 4 is 2 into 2 to 0, 4, 2 into 4 is 8. So, initial rate was increased by 8 times. Then it is option C is a correct answer. This is a foolproof method. But, you know, in examination, solving by this full full, uh, full uh, proof method takes you some time. Instead of, uh, you know, doing, you know, like 60 seconds and all, just uh, less than that time you can solve. I will tell you the methodology. For example, uh, read this question. See how easily you can do. This is the rate expression, right? You want to know the trick? Huh? Uh, A is increased by 4 times. Directly you put 4 here. A plus. 4 to the power of 1 by 2. See how I am doing? 4 to the power of 1 by 2. What? Why am I am keeping A value 4? Because they, were, they told that A increased by 4. So directly I am keeping 4 here. 4 to the power of 1 by 2. And B how much? It is 2. So I will keep 2 here. 2 square is how much? 4. 4 to the power of 1 by 2 means uh, root 4 is 2. In This is 2 square is 4. 2 4s are 8. In, in Here only you can do it. If you, if you follow this methodology, you should take paper and pen, rough paper and all. But uh, you know, here only you can do it. Suppose I will give you another example. For the uh, reaction, uh, here they have given for a reaction, the initial rate is given as this one. R0 is equal to K A0 square into B. By what factor the initial rate of a reaction will increase if initial concentration of A is taken 1.5 times. So A how much time they were telling? A is increased by 1.5 times and B is increased by how much? Tripled. Tripled means 3. 3. Here 3. Nothing is there means 1 is there. See B to the power of nothing is there means B order is 1. Just substitute and find it out without any methods. But you know just to simply you have to find it out. Okay. Don't do in this method. Whatever method I told you just to try. This is your test yourself question. I will give you its answer in the next video. And I will show you the uh, trick number 2. Like another method of problem. This is a box problem. Uh, see here, uh, they have, they will give you the box. There are uh, four types of box problems. In this video, I will cover you most frequently asked box problem. Uh, you know, uh, see this is a, a rate expression given. 
whenever they are asking you order of the reaction first observe that box first point you should keep in a mind that a box contains what if the box contains concentrations and the rate then it comes under the method initial rate method which method initial rate method when you have to use this initial rate method when concentrations is given and the rate is given then only you have to use a methodology which i am uh, which i am uh, teaching you now and after that uh, you know uh, write the expressions i will name it as i will name it as equation this is my equation 1 this is my equation 2 okay and this is my equation 3 i am having three three experiments 1 2 3 i will take step by step first i will take you know 3 by 1 3 by 1 i'll take so in a textbook they'll divide like this equation 3 by 1 but you will be getting a doubt why they are taking 3 by 1 why not 2 by 1 or why not 1 by 2 here the concept is this is a rate expression right which two values of a is constant you have to take that one first ma'am why only a i will take b which two values are constant yeah okay you can take which two values of b are constant those two equations let me explain you step by step first i will take i will write the rate uh, rate of rate value how much for experiment number 3 this is a rate value 0.08 which is equal to uh, cons k into what is the concentration of a a concentration is 0.2 see how i am substituted very easy and its power its power is you know order is a i am writing a and b b to the power of b here this is a b concentration 0.4 to the power of b this is experiment number 3 you know this one but what i what i take is divide by equation 1 only i take because these two values are constant of a you have to take that then what is equation number 1 r 0.04 divided by k into uh, 0.2 this is also 0.2 so 0.2 this is also 0.2 b now cancel it cancel it this is 4 1 sir 4 2 sir then this is both are cancel this is kk cancel 2 ones are 2 two twos are then it will be 2 is equal to 2 to the power of b if bases are equal you can you can take so order with respect to b is 1 if bases are equal see nothing is there means 1 is there b order is 1 b order is 1 i mean b is equal to 1 b is equal to 1 what is the meaning of b is equal to 1 tell me what is the meaning of b is equal to 1 here b to order is b its value is 1 its value is 1 clear now let me uh, tell you how to find the order with respect to a so what you what you have to do is you have to take if you want to find order of a you should take b value constant in which two experiments b is constant in this you should not take these two because b is varying you take these two so that b order is constant let, let me find Uh, rate is equal to e equation number three by experiment number three by experiment number two. I am taking rate is zero point zero eight, which is equal to k into zero point two. Our uh, order is uh, a, and uh, its order is zero point four. Order is b, and then divided by experiment number two is zero point zero four k, and uh, a or a value is zero point one. Order is a, and b value is zero point four. Order is B. Here, what you can do is you can cancel which are same. These two are same. Strike it off. And here one sir, two sir. Here two. And here one sir. Here two sir. Then what K K is constant. Then what is left here? Tell me two is equal to two to the power of A. Then A is equal to nothing is there means one is there. If bases are same, you can equate exponents. A is equal to one. What is the order of A? A is one and B is also one. What is the correct option? Option number one is correct. This is regular format, regular NCERT method. This one. Now what I do is this much of time it is consuming na time way. Uh, you know it, it takes some time to write. For writing only it, it takes time. I will tell you the best method. See how easily you can do it. First. 
in in mind only you have to do take this question like this. whatever question is given on the paper only you can do first observe which two are constants directly remove that with respect these two constant values you are taking in the sense you are not finding the order with respect to a that fix in mind what is that students which two values you are taking constant that one order you are not finding okay a order you are not finding you are finding b order so b order 0.4 divided by 2 how much ma'am which how i can take you better take higher value by lower value 0.4 higher 0.2 low so, so 0.4 divided by 0.2 so how much two ones are two twos are so you got two in your mind just two you write one side another side three by two you are writing the no? four ones are four two sir then what you are getting here two you are getting with respect to b b value got two so two to the power of b right in a question two to the power of b then b is equal to one is the order that's it see this is the same method what i have kept on paper but you know when you do it on your mind in uh, in your mind then it takes very less time see the next one for example you you got the order b with respect to b is 1 now you want to find with respect to a observe caref carefully you want to find with respect to a you don't want b so b value you have to take constant in which two experiments it is constant these two experiments it is constant so don't write it on a paper same method but you know without writing in paper on paper i'm telling you this 0.4 0.4 constant right so don't see that and b are not finding and now you have to take these two experiments right then 0.2 divided by 0.1 how much ones are two sir you got a two Two in your mind, you got two, and what is the order with respect to a? Order is small a, which is equal to take two rates also point four one sir two sir. Then you got two. Nothing is there one. A is equal to one. That's it. That's it. See one more example. You may feel that you know don't use a full format, uh, full method. What I told you this long method you don't use. Just you use in your mind only this question. Uh, we will see how you you can solve. After that, I'll give you test yourself questions. Uh, select the rate law that corresponds to the data shown below. Then when you have to apply initial rate method, what I'm telling, if you have concentrations with respect to rate, then only have to use this method. Point number one. this method is used useful for finding the rate first if you know the rate later you can calculate rate constant also in this video i am covering the rate order how to calculate order uh, fine and just observe uh, what is your rate expression rate expression is equal to rate is equal to k into a into b this is an expression this is a for this you are writing rate this is a this is b you want to find a you want to find b done and then which two values are constant as i told you first you do, you want to find for b if you want to find for uh, uh, b means a value have to take constant see a value in this two it is constant or in this two also it is constant fine you can take these two or these two your wish suppose i am taking these two no ha huh, these two i am taking if i take these two these two values higher value by lower value ones are two sir okay done I got two, b value two. I got uh, two to the power of order is b, which is equal to rate how much? These two, if I take zero point one, zero point zero one, sir, eight, sir. Then so eight. Then eight bases should be equal. Then only we can take base equal means how can we write two cube? We have to take then order with respect to b is three. You got the order with respect to B is three. How easy! You know, instead of writing the whole and wasting your time, you can do like this. Easy, right? If you feel this one nice, please hit on the like. And see here, uh, A or B order you calculated. Now you want to find A order. A order, how much you want to find? Then take B value which two are constants. See here, zero point three, zero point three constant. Okay, here zero point zero three five zero point zero. Then take these two experiments. What I'm telling you, take these two experiments. If you take these two experiments, then this is how much zero point zero one two. This so this is one sir, this is two sir. Okay, one side you got two, but you see other side. Other side, 
ये कॉन्सेंट्रेशन इज चेंजिंग बट रेट रिमाइन सेम वेन एवर रेट रिमाइन सेम दट रेट इज जीरो ऑर्डर यू नो नीड टू कैलकुलेट दिस इज इन द बेस्ट मेथड यू नो सपोज यू गॉट डाउट मैम बी रेट इज ऑर्डर इज बिकमिंग जीरो मैम देन यू टेक अनदर टू वैल्यू जीरो पॉइंट सेवन जीरो पॉइंट दिस इज ऑल्सो कॉन्स्टेंट राइट इधर दिस इज टू आर कॉन्स्टेंट्स और दिस टू आर कॉन्स्टेंट हियर ऑल्सो ऑब्जर्व जीरो पॉइंट एट जीरो जीरो पॉइंट एट जीरो विच मीन्स दैट इफ यू मेंटेन बी कॉन्सेंट्रेशन कॉन्स्टेंट इफ यू चेंज ए ऑल्सो ए कॉन्सेंट्रेशन बट रेट रिमाइंड constant in the sense you know simply order is a value is zero some summary i will tell you so much i told na if if two values are constants okay b concentration that time you will take the ratio of these two that time you see rate if rate value 0.8 0.8 remains constant in the sense order with respect to that species Order with respect to a is zero. Now see, uh, we have got in this a value zero, b value three. Then it is rate is equal. If something is zero, you no need to write that. If you change its concentration also, there will be no impact in a rate. Then uh, rate is equal to k into b to the power of three. First option is your correct answer. Now I will give you the test yourself questions. This is the question I have given you, and I'll show you some more questions also. Next video I will give the solution to that. Check it out. This is the uh, question from NCERT. Take this tabular column. Take this tabular column. I have uh, suppose rate is equal. This is the equation. This is the equation. I will write you the rate here. Rate is equal to k into n o to the power of some here two is given but uh, you can't take coefficient as an order we don't know that then it will be you know i'm taking a and o to to the power of b so you have to find a and you have to find b use this tabular column take a screenshot and start solving next one is see what type of questions they are asked in ncert 4.10 solve this question write slow first time when you are doing write slowly step by step you do but in when you are solving this question you will definitely stuck at one point where you will stuck how to solve that i will teach you in the solution video next video and this question you don't stuck you don't stuck neatly you can do and find the order um, this question try doing full method and after doing full method just to do the shortcut also like in mind only you try to do so it saves your time first full method then in a just you uh, know one or two steps uh, do it i will teach you the solutions for these four questions total four questions which i have given in uh, as a test yourself my name is komali i am your chemistry mentor uh, thank you so much for watching this video and in our channel komali ma'am channel almost 380 plus videos are there all are different different tricks i have uploaded go through those tricks and excellent content is there still if you want to learn chemistry in a systematic manner i am taking online class Uh, this in classes you can learn every chapter see here you are learning one or two tricks right for example this kind of box models four different models are there okay one model i have taken and it various uh, you know problems uh, you i made you to solve in this model but uh, you know when you come to the coaching everything in a systematic manner ch every chapter you can learn that too in a short duration that is the advantage of course if you want to uh, you want me as your mentor i will give my whatsapp number in the description of this video just send your 10 mark sheet photo and later you can ask whatever the details whichever course course you are expecting then i will provide you uh, details according to that thank you